Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. That's my knowledge part, and today we will discuss regarding that question number seventh one. Either it is seventh or eighth, whatsoever it is, but it is meant for reference to the context. It is for tenth standard annual exam. Sometimes in revision exam, such type of the problems are supposed to be asked. Then how to be solved? This is very important. What do you mean by reference to the context? That question will be there or annotate the following. At that time, what one has to do? Reference to the context. It means he explain with the reference to the context. In that one, what always happens generally in tenth standard annual exam that to a first language. I mean, in English medium, three reference to the context are supposed to be asked from the pro section and two. Reference to the context are supposed to be asked from poetry section. Always it is, either it is revision test, either it is a model test, either it is preparatory exam, or it is an annual exam. Then what supposed to be done for that one? That is very important. Generally, in many of the schools, what do they do? They conduct the exam of tenth standard that to on every twenty five percent of syllabus. And hence, at least four exams are supposed to be taken before the preparatory exam. And after that, four revision tests have been conducted. Later on, there will be one preparatory exam, and after that, there will be an annual exam. So this is the what we can say schedule of each and every schools. So that is secondary matter. What I mean to say that my aim is to make you understand what do you mean by reference to the context. In this one. What the first problem is there? First problem is that what kind of work would you like? This is the first reference to the context. And second one, what is there? Rain-fed tanks are so common in South India. This is second one. And what is third one? The flow of water has undoubtedly played a great role or great part. Now fourth one. See, circle the sky in moment of grace, and last one, teach him for every enemy there is a friend. What are these? These are the references. So, how we have to solve that problem which carries fifteen marks? Keep it in your mind, dears. Apart from reference to the context, that po prose and poetry, whatever the questions are going to ask, they are purely meant for forty-eight marks. Later on. The grammatical part will have been asked, so this can be said as an heart of that question paper. So, what kind of work would you like? Reference to the context. It means what one has to do. Whenever you have been asked, you explain with the reference to the context at that time. What you have to do? You have to find out that from which lesson or from which poem that given sentence or the line has been taken. First thing. Later on. who is the author of that particular lesson or who is the poet of that particular poem later on what is the intention behind that saying such type of the references if you have written these all things then you will be given three marks three problems carry three marks how if you have written the name of the lesson You will be given one mark. If you have written the name of the author, you will be given another one mark. And last one for explanation. Now, what is first one? What kind of work would you like? We have to find it out from which lesson it has been taken. It is clear. There are ten lessons and ten poems. First one lesson, what it is there? A wrong man in workers' paradise. So it is written by. Ravindra Nath Tagore. So the first dialogue, what kind of work would you like, is taken from. How you have to write this statement has been taken from the lesson, comma United comma starts. That is a wrong man in workers paradise. United comma closed. Full stop. Next line. What you have to write next line. This lesson has been written by. Who is the Writer, his name you have to write. Who is the writer of the first lesson? That is a wrong man in workers' paradise, Ravindranath Tagore. So if we have written in next slide, Ravindranath Tagore. 
Now, what is the intention behind that? This statement, what kind of work would you like? This dialogue is by a girl of a silent torrent. When that wrong man went into the worker's paradise, and in between or through regular interval, he is going to disturb her whenever she is feeling the water. At that time, he asks to her that, I would like to have some work from your hand. Then she just replied, what kind of work would you like? Matter is over here. If you have written this much, you will be given three marks. And remember my dears, it is so easy to score because if while teaching or whenever you are going through the YouTube, whatsoever it is the YouTube, if you have gone through carefully, definitely you will understand. You are not supposed to be in daydream. That is very important. Oh, three marks we have got. How it is? The statement has been taken from the lesson. That is a wrong man in workers paradise. It is written by Ravindranath Tagore. I am the girl of a silent torrent asked to a man who was going to disturb her through regular interval whenever she was going to fetch a water. Next one, rain fed tanks are so common in South India. What it is? This also one of the references. It is also the same and that same formula we have to use. How the same formula we have to use? Rain fed tanks are so common in South India. This statement has been taken from the lesson, The Elixir of Life. And this lesson has been written by the author. His name is C.V. Raman. Now, what he says, rain fed tanks are so common in South India. Generally in the season, June to August or September, whenever there is a raining, at the time, the wells, the canals, as well as the lakes, and hence, a slight, what you can say, little puddles are supposed to be filled by the water. And it appears so beautiful. It is one of the best sightseeing at South India especially. And hence he says that generally and on the contrary, at northern part of India, it is not so. Because northern part of India, there are many valleys are there and big rivers are there. But they are not going to find as rain fed tanks are so common in South India. So whenever raining is there, at that time, that rain fed tanks are so commonly appear at the southern part of India and it appears so beautiful to see and hence he says so. Now first one is over, second one is also over, now third one. What is the third one? Third one, the flow of water has undoubtedly played a great role or part. From which lesson it has been taken? Just we have to confirm, if you have gone through each and every lesson properly, if you have gone through each and every poem properly, definitely you can solve this problem in so easy way. There is no doubt. But generally what happens, only teacher reads and simply you listen. But you are never going to, what we can say, read that particularly and particular lessons because nowadays you are very busy. Am I right? Because you have a lot of work. What is a lot of work? I having that smartphone and just going through varieties of the functions. So how you can, what you can say, concentrate yourselves. Yes, it has become so easy for you because uncountable YouTube, what you can say, YouTubers are there, they are going to uh, just uh, uploading so many videos, simply you are watching and just you are enjoying. Do you know? Yeah, you don't do so. And then if you have to score, that you know, my dears, become you have to become somewhere serious. Then only it, it becomes possible. It Otherwise, it is highly impossible. Now, the flow of water has undoubtedly played a great part. What it is? Hey, this is also from which lesson this, this statement has been taken that you have to confirm. From which lesson already I told you. I informed you. What I told you? Whenever the problem of reference to the context is going to occur in your annual exam or in your preparatory exam or even your revision test, at that time, three reference to the context are always coming from pro section. Keep it in your mind. Mind it what I am going to tell you. Ye patthar ke upar ki lakir ki tarah hai. Teen ye reference to the context pros mein hai. Pros mein ke hi aata hai. Aur do pro poetry ke aata hai. Two are from poetry. Three are from pros. 100% quite sure. There is no doubt at all. Understand. Now, the flow of water has undoubtedly played a great role or great part. Yes, it is. If there is no raining, understand why? Yeah, whenever the flow of water has undoubtedly played a great role or great part, 
if you have taken the example of soil erosion at that time the flow of water has played a very very great role now how you have to confirm that one again the same what it is this statement has been taken from the second lesson that is the elixir of life and it is written by cv raman that is the first language english that too in karnataka state keep it in your mind now how you have to write the same how i have, how we have written how you have solved the problem of question number first that what kind of work would you like second one rain fed tanks are so common in south india third one the flow of water has undoubtedly played a great part it means that the statement has been taken from the lesson that is a elixir of life it is written by cv raman and whenever there is a raining or whenever there is a water at that time how the flow of water is essential to farming also and as well as to destroy the whole system of farming also regarding that he is going to say and hence he says that always one of the dangerous of danger or one of the dangerous thing regarding the soil erosion how the soil erosion is going to take place and what steps are supposed to be taken to what we can say stop the soil erosion later on that question number fourth one see circle the sky in moments of grace what you have to do remember in fourth one what one has to do in fourth one you have to do that whenever there is a problem of prose we have to say this statement and whenever the problem of poetry then you have to say this single line how this single line has been taken from the poem the first poem's name is to a pair of sorrows crain and it is written by manmohan singh when the hunters have killed to the male crain at that time that female sorrows crane circled and just she was going to send a message to the god that regarding the cruelty of the hunters so that is going to what you can say explain in this line she circled the she circled the sky in the moments of grace and last one what it is that teach him for every enemy there is a there is a friend or there is a scoundrel so what one has to do here what it is there that question number 5th one problem number 5th one is from the second poem that is abraham lincoln's letter to his son's teacher remember how you have to write then the single line has been taken from the from the poem that abraham lincoln's letter to his son's teacher and the the poet of that poem is abraham lincoln and what he is going to say he is indirectly writing a letter to his teacher and saying that the whole world is not filled by the mad people i 